Right, let's see what's been going on on YouTube. 600k and you don't show your face. Not just a pussy, but your family's disgrace. Ah, uh, okay then. It's me, Mewless, bro. It's me, Mewless, bro. I said it's me, Mewless, bro. Right, so if you've been a carbon-based life form at any point in the last month, you know about all the Sidemen and KSI diss tracks circulating, but I'm 100% sure literally no one gives a single one about it anymore. But I've had some diss tracks sent my way by a couple of YouTubers. First off, we got Will and Lee here, so let's see what he's got to say about me. Femulous, I didn't want to cuss you, I did. but this ain't an idle threat. We can all see what you've just done, still this week on the internet. Ah, y y yeah, that's a fair one. Even nab the consistency and all. But moving on, let's see what our mate I'm Alex had to say about me. This diss track will put you in a brace. Memulus is under 5 foot 8. Yeah, did I mention that? Memulus is under 5 foot 8. Uh, Alex, y you're literally exactly the same height as me. And then we had a couple of diss tracks just from like kids borrowing their mum's iPads. I've had so much guns in my pocket. But we also have one from this guy that I made a video on about one and a half to two years ago. Like, y you took your time, mate. Now, usually he makes the sort of videos where he goes up to people in public and asks them questions. Put off for, like, a girl, like, the worst thing a girl can do. But today he's taken a break from asking children about what their turn-offs are and sent a diss track my way. I really wish I was joking when I say that this is his actual intro. Like, I haven't altered it in any way. This is exactly how it is in the video. Like, it takes up about an eighth of the screen. If we ever met, man, I wouldn't break a sweat. Yeah, I'd punch you in the neck and then I'd leave you as a dead man. Is that even a diss? Usually a diss is something like your mum's a virgin. Saying you're gonna punch me in the neck and leave me as a dead man. That's just a straight up threat. YouTube money, go and buy your mum a spray tan. Her birthday is coming up. I think someone needs to teach our guy what a diss is. Because... I, I'm not quite sure YouTube money go and buy your mama spray tan her birthday's coming up really constitutes as a diss I got a nice plan we can meet up and she can get it off a black man Ah, oh, there we go the classic I shagged your mum slash I'm going to shag your mum diss he's really upping his game here but like for real has anyone actually ever been offended by a your mum diss or, or is that just like a myth anyway after that he then ends the diss with this I'll punch you in the balls and then I'll leave you with no gender Yo, guys, don't hit on him in it. Like you say, go show him some love. Well, um, uh, thanks. I mean, your mood changed pretty quickly. Like, you pretty much threatened to castrate me. And then literally a second later, you're telling people to go show me some love. Uh, okay, then. <laughs> right, so it's been a good few months since I talked about BG Media. And that's mainly because it's been a bit quiet and uh, also I milked it dry. But since all the Sidemen diss tracks have been going on, Jax dusted off his camera and got back on it. Like, we've had Afghan Dan make a Sidemen diss track and Little T make a diss track on Sophie Aspin. Like, uh, of course he has. But the best one I found this month is probably one of the least viewed. It's called Bedtime by Courtney Jade. And when I first saw this pop up in my sub feed, I, I didn't think it'd be anything special. But oh, 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 I, I was wrong. So the video starts off with the signature visuals by Jack Wilkinson and the obligatory We Know What You Done. We know what you done. And then it, it gets into the good bit. Sophie, baby, Jade is here, sending bars, yeah, I'm, I, I am lost for words. Like, I'm fully convinced at this point that Jack has either combined the DNA of Millie B and So Fastbin to create the ultimate send machine, or all girls in Blackpool look exactly the same. Like, seriously, if you're a girl and cross the border into Blackpool, do you just suddenly obtain ginger hair and a spray tan? Jade is like a ram sending shot. Sophie, baby, you got best parts. Also, can I just say, this is the most uncharismatic diss track I've ever witnessed. Like, come on, at least put a bit of heart into it. But moving on, Blackpool's finest Afghan Dan decided to splash out on an I-8, make a send on the Sidemen and um, make some unusual disses. Um, right then, Dan. Okay, so as most of you know, this month I started Team 100. Limited edition Team 100 merch still available for one more day. Link in the description. But since I uploaded my last video about Team 100, I've had a couple more uh, Team 100 related videos come through. Like, first of all, that kid that made It's Memeulous Bro dropped another song called M M Meme Church. When Memeulous took my vid, yeah, blew up. But when I wrote some comments, man, I almost threw up. 
all the haters calling me just want me to screw up. I mean, at least he's being realistic. Like, most of these diss tracks I've seen have featured, like, Ferraris and Rolls Royces. But now, nah, this kid kept it real and jumped in his dad's transit. But this next one is um, something quite special. Um, I've seen other YouTubers have this done to them before, but it's never happened to me, and I, I never expected it to happen to me. Saying Memulus a hundred thousand times. And he just sits and says my name constantly for an hour. Memulus. 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 Why did he choose to put himself through this? Bim bom, bim bom. Right, so last month, Big Ben bonged for the last time for four years. A UK TV show this morning bought on a girl that wanted to replace Big Ben. Okay, off you go. Bim bom, bim bom. Bim bim bom. And who said British people have no culture? Also, right, how did this even get on TV? Like, first of all, the parents. How did they think it would be a good idea to put their child on national TV saying she wants to replace Big Ben by saying bing bong bing bong? And then secondly, who at ITV actually approved this and was like, oh yeah, you know what our show's been missing? A girl that can imitate a big clock. Get all the girl girls. With the big right, so the National Lottery decides to do one of them things on Twitter where people can send in like their name or a picture of them and it comes up as a tweet on their feed saying like thank you or something because you know when Walkers did that, that, that went really well. But anyway, the, the National Lottery decided to do a similar thing to Walkers and uh, it, it didn't go too well. I mean, they did a good call of not letting people send pictures in but they still essentially let people write tweets on their profile. Like we had British athletes holding up signs saying things like this me daddy. I enjoy kids, your dad sells Avon, and simply Adam Johnson. <laughs> but yeah, let this be a lesson to every company out there. Letting people from the Twitter community essentially post on your profile is never a good idea. Jake Paul did some stuff this month. Yeah. YouTube is an awful place. Right, so as a lot of you would know, over the last, like, five or six months, YouTube have had a load of really bad problems with their site. Like, some creators are being paid, like, a tenth of what they used to get. People are essentially losing their jobs and livelihoods. I mean, they've started this thing where you can kind of appeal the limited ads, but they've only given that to a few people for some reason. But what do they do instead of fixing these issues and rolling out the appeal process to everyone? They change their layout and logo, of course. It's always good to see they're investing their time in the things that matter. Right, but anyway guys, that's the end of this episode of Last Month This Happened and I hope you did enjoy it. If we could get this video to 30,000 likes, that'd be banging. But yeah, anyway guys, as I said, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to subscribe and smash that like button.